Welcome back to more Civilization 4. I am hoping to finally take Persepolis in this episode, man. It's getting a little ridiculous. But we will see. I just need some final preparations here, and I think we should be good to go. Hmm. What do I want to do here? I want to keep clearing forest. I might as well. Clear some jungle. Let me move this catapult to the front line. And honestly, I can probably move a couple of these swordsmen out to the front line as well. Some of my swordsmen there are still healing. So I'm going to wait another turn before I attack. I'll keep the defenses down here. All right. The wisest men follow their own direction. So I got the compass. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and go for philosophy. Our shipmasters have devised a way to reinforce the hulls of our triremes. This will help both ramming and being rammed. So, it's a random event. Am I ready to take this city? I don't think I am. I need more actual ground units here. I think I'm going to start recalling some of these units. And let me just kind of hang tight for now. clear more jungle why not so there are three archer man I cannot keep up with this my warriors need to finish healing man they're just taking forever to heal I'm gonna wait another turn here ah what a disaster. So they're moving some archers out. Finally got Notre Dame built. That's nice. That's really going to help. Pretty sweet. Nice. So I do need to kind of pump out some I guess some units. What do I want to build though? Swordsmen, axemen. I don't know. Kind of tempted to build some axemen. Kind of fuel the industry a little bit. And let me just kind of build some roads. Chop that jungle. Let me bombard this city. Let me bombard that city. And let me just kind of hang tight for now. These guys still not... Man, I didn't realize it took that long to heal. That's crazy, man. So now that I have the barracks here, I can really start pumping out some units. Alright, I'm gonna go for this, and I'm gonna try to do some collateral damage. I'm probably gonna lose these catapults. 
But that's okay. As long as I'm doing a little bit of collateral damage. Really? I lost that 85% chance there? That was really annoying. Okay, there you go. So we finished that, and I'm actually inclined to raise the city. I'm not too intrigued by it, honestly. Let me see... Let me see what it's got. I mean, it's really... It's got a monument. I mean, no. I am not interested in this. I'm just gonna raise it. Alright, I am... I'm okay with that. I think I might want to try to attack some of these units trying to reinforce Persepolis. In fact... I might just do that. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and destroy that guy. Alright. Let me bring everybody back. To this spot here. Okay. So yeah, I definitely want to steamroll that, but look at all the units he has there. Man. I just... This is just crazy. I just don't know if I'll ever be able to take that city. So I got an Axeman there. I'm just going to start pumping Axeman out. A great beast has been discovered near one of our hunting camps. Let it breed to give off offspring. That will give me plus one food in this plot. Looks like it could feed many people. This would give me plus one population. And then hunt it. Are you mad? The beast is a manifestation of a divine spirit. That will give me plus one happiness in all my Christian cities for 40 turns. It's pretty decent. I think I'm going to do that. And honestly, I just don't know what else to do. I guess I can go build plantations here. Yeah, I need to go build plantations up there. So maybe I can do that. So let me start moving these axemen to the front. Hmm. I need to come develop some of these tiles that are being worked here. There's not much going on in them. Sorry about that. I hate when I forget to silence my phone before starting to record. But you know what it is. We try, we try. Let me keep the defenses low here. I have four workers here. That's crazy. I guess that's from all the... I guess I captured them from all these tiles here. So let me go build some stuff. Why not? Oh, I did the same thing I did last time. Where I 
threw a worker right in front of my enemy. So it looks like there's some unhealthiness in this city. I'm going to build something to try and offset that. I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to build an aqueduct. That gives me plus two health. And my Christianity is spreading, thankfully. That is good. Let me move this swordsman here. Hmm. Why is that tile not being worked? See, like, that's a pretty crappy tile to be working. Same with that one. As opposed to... Wait a minute, why... Why can't I work this tile here? Why can't I work that tile? I'm not sure why I can't work that tile. It's not making much sense. Maybe because I have a worker on it? I don't know. That's really weird. Keeps killing all my workers. Silly. Let me go with Axeman. Let me build more Axemen. In fact, I should be able to take the Spearmen on finally. if I can finally I don't know why can't I work that tile why can't I work this does anybody know why I can't get to that that's so weird is that a lack of a road there is that what it is hmm Actually, let me come over here and build a floodplain. And I'm going to build a plantation here. Go ahead and attack this guy. 77.7% .7 chance. Nice. Got rid of him. Let me go ahead and build a cottage. Looks like I got access to some piggies. That's nice. So Medina is pretty sick too. I do need some health. That being said... 
Let me build an Axeman. And more Axeman. All right. I mean, there's a road to it already. Yeah, I don't know what's going on there. I don't know why I can't work that tile. I'm very confused, though. This game can be kind of silly sometimes. Sometimes I just don't understand. Let me upgrade this guy to an X-Men. And I'm going to move both of these out. I got the aqueduct, which is great. Go ahead and build a courthouse to decrease the maintenance cost. And then over here, I'm going to keep making some Axemen. Hmm. Market might be helpful. But so would more Axemen, especially here at the front. I know I keep saying this, but I should be ready to attack soon. I'm so confused. I really don't get why I can't work this tile. Why can't I work that? Am I going crazy? Am I going nuts? See, I try to click it and it just gets me out of the map. Sometimes you have to reduce one of these. But I can't click on it. That's so weird. I don't know, man. That's weird. Build a farm requires civil service. Interesting. I don't know. Maybe I'll just throw a cottage there. Let me keep moving some axemen to the front. I have gained this by philosophy. That I do without being commanded what others do only from fear of the law. Okay. What did I build? I have founded Taoism in Medina. That's interesting because now I have. I mean, this founded Christianity and Taoism, which is weird. Okay, let me go ahead and go for optics. My water supply also got contaminated here, which kind of sucks. I don't want Taoism to spread. I want to make sure I'm remaining Christian. Because that's what my other cities are.
All right, next turn I'm attacking, dude. For real. So the, that was missionary. And I'm probably just going to delete him. I don't want anything to do with him. Because I don't want him spreading Taoism. So the Vikings want me to cancel my deals with the English not happening for now. You know, I never knew that you could found two religions in the same city. I thought the game mechanics prevented that, but I guess I was completely wrong. So, more Axemen here. Let me keep building Axemen. Alright, that's it, guys. I'm going in. I'm going in. I don't even care anymore. Let me first go in with the catapults. I'm going to take lots of casualties here, but hopefully I can do some splatter damage. So I'm going to lose all these catapults probably, and that's intentional. Nobody freak out. Actually, I got, I got all these weird units selected. I just want the catapults. All right. Intentional, guys. It was intentional. Let me go in with the trebuchets. Alright. Doing lots of good splash damage. Gonna go in with these Axemen. Really? I lost that at 69? Oh, come on, dude. I'm getting so unlucky. Ah, I'm mad. Alright. Okay. We're down to our chariots, which is not good, because they're... I'm only at a 14% chance here, which kind of sucks. And he still has a lot of units here. I killed all those units, and he still has... Two spearmen, three archers, and two swordsmen? He still has a ton of units. Hmm. So, if I were to attack with these chariots, my chances are pretty low. But I am kind of sick of these chariots, honestly. I'm just going to throw some numbers here. I'm probably going to lose a lot, if not all of these units. Actually, I don't know why my odds just increased dramatically, but I'll take it. Oh, I guess it's because all their units are weakened. Alright. Nice. Finally! Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't believe it, guys. And I'm definitely going to take control of this city. This is an excellent city. So, yep. We will definitely do that. And I think the first thing that I'm going to build is what am I going to build here what do I want to build here I don't know I guess I'm going to go with a work boat man going to start exploiting these sea resources it'll be good why did I lose access to this tile wow that's weird my borders kind of shrank I guess for lack of better terms. Hmm. Alright. So I have a great general. Nice. And I guess I'm just gonna... I'm going to have him join the city, honestly. Okay. And next. This is really bugging me. I still can't figure out why I can't work this tile. 
Okay, I'm gonna stop worrying about it. Or it's gonna drive me nuts. Oh, so he's already attacking immediately, which is a problem. All right, what do I want to build in this city? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll build a missionary, a Christian monastery, I mean. That'll give me a little bit of culture, a little bit of research. So... Yeah, these cities are pretty sick. So I am going to move... I'm going to move all my units here to the city. And I'm just going to keep marching them to basically destroy the Persian Empire. Let me move them over here. Let me let them heal up a little bit. And chop down this forest. And let me just kind of go over that way. I'm gonna build a windmill here. Got some axemen. Which I am going to send all the way to Persepolis. So I'm going to go develop this oasis. These people, man, keep asking for handouts. I'm not going to give him meditation. No thanks. So I got an axeman there. What do I want? I'm going to build a market. I'm going to focus on the economy a little bit. I'm going to do a courthouse to decrease my expenses. All right. And let me move this guy up here. So we should be able to hopefully wipe out the Persians. You know, I'm not too interested in that city. I'll be quite honest. I'll probably end up raising it. But I do want to destroy my mortal enemy. That would be excellent. So let me do some city raider upgrades here. Let me as well do... Hmm. Let me do just some increased combat strength. And get these units healing up. Maybe I should just start sprinkling cottages everywhere. I don't know. No, oh, I can't really build anything on this tile. That's kind of weird. Alright, fine. can't believe I finally got Persepolis, dude. That was crazy. That was a terrible war planning on my part. I understand 
I realize my fault in all of this. I'm going to get a couple of Christian missionaries going. To keep spreading that religion. Alright, so I'm going to leave... I'm going to upgrade these guys to crossbowmen. And you know what? I'm going to grab pretty much everybody else. And we are going to go take the next city. And we got a couple of these guys over here. And these guys, I'm going to keep moving them. Axemen, I will move them with the rest of the army. I'm just going to start sprinkling cottages, guys. I don't know what else to do, honestly. Okay, what else can I build in this city? I mean, this is pretty beefed out as it is. There's really not much left for me to do here. I'm going to build some walls. Just to kind of help protect those, because those are important cities for me. And I'm going to let him go free roam and try to spread Christianity. So it looks like they're expanding this way. So they probably have another city up here now. So I'm going to have to try and steamroll this really quickly. One doesn't discover new lands without losing sight of the shore. Okay. Let me go ahead and work on feudalism. We got another Christian missionary here. I'm gonna build a Colosseum to help with the happiness in the city. I'm gonna let this Christian missionary do his thing. This worker can come up here and build that iron mine. All right, so all these guys can kind of come up here. Same with these two. Let's see. Let me just keep doing what I'm doing. Building cottages. That's what I do. Why not? I'm just going to blast a ton of cottages. See what happens. So, castle, give me culture, plus one trade routes, 50% defense, blah, blah, blah. Let's do it. Let's build a castle. All right, so let me heal these units. Let me kind of fortify here. Kind of hang around there. Alright, let me build that mine. Got an axeman, which I can go do that. So it looks like I was successful in establishing Christianity over there. Okay. Let me start bombarding the city. OK, 
Okay, it's down to zero. Excellent. Let me let them heal one more turn. Let me see what my odds are over here. 26. I'm going to wait one more turn. And build cottage. Building cottages all day, dude. Yes, because I don't know how else to play this game. I'm hoping by the next round, I will have done a lot more. Again, it's been so many years since I played the game that I only remember the basics. So, you know, I'm just kind of playing this first round, kind of remembering how the game works. And then before I do the next round, I'm going to go do a lot of reading now that I know what to read about. And then hopefully that'll make a big impact. Okay. Let's keep pushing here. Hmm. Hagia Sophia. You know what? Let me build one. Why not? Catapult. I'm going to start attacking. Yeah, this should- I should steamroll this. Nice. You know, that's actually a pretty decent city. It'll kind of put me in the middle between my other two. There's some resources here, some good food resources. I can build a ton of wonders here by chopping down some forest. So I'm actually going to install a new governor. And I'm going to go ahead and build a worker. Because I'm going to need to start developing some land. It looks like they started spreading north though to try and save themselves. I'm going to keep chasing them down. I want to destroy the Persian Empire. And then I will go into a period of peace and really kind of build up the cities a little bit. But that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed and see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.